Hello, everyone. My name is Zhang Yanling, and I am an engineer at Huawei. Today, I'd like to discuss the comparison test of Huawei's intelligent lossless network and traditional InfiniBand (IB) network in high-performance computing (HPC) scenarios. HPC is primarily used for large-scale scientific computing and the processing of massive data. As such, it has high requirements on network throughput, latency, and packet loss. To achieve high throughput and low latency, remote direct memory access (RDMA) technology is widely used across the industry to replace the traditional TCP technology. However, RDMA is sensitive to packet loss. Even a 1% packet loss rate causes the network throughput to decrease to zero. To ensure zero packet loss on the network, IB is typically used as the network layer protocol to transmit RDMA traffic. However, as IB is a proprietary protocol with a siloed architecture, it is often incompatible with large-scale live IP networks. And involves high operation costs. As a result, RDMA over Ethernet is increasingly applied to HPC scenarios. Huawei provides the intelligent lossless network solution for data centers in HP scenarios, based on the innovative intelligent lossless algorithm. The solution implements zero packet loss at 100% throughput. Surpassing the network performance requirements of HPC services. Next, let's talk about the performance comparison between Huawei's intelligent lossless network and traditional IB networks. First, we set up two sets of test environments: one for IB-based Bera network, and the other for Huawei's intelligent lossless network. Both environments have the same networking architecture, link bandwidth, and test parameter settings. We can then perform comparison tests in terms of bandwidth, latency, network-wide performance, and HPC applications. The first test relates to bandwidth in congestion scenarios. We send traffic from multiple servers to one server to simulate in-cast traffic. In the two environments, according to the test result, the bandwidth performance of Huawei's intelligent lossless network closely matches that of the IB network in both intraleaf and intraleaf congestion scenarios. Next, let's examine the latency test in congestion scenarios. In this case, we also simulate in-cast traffic in the two environments. To test end-to-end -end latency performance, according to the test result, the latency of Huawei's intelligent lossless network is much lower than that of the IB network in both intraleaf and intraleaf congestion scenarios. Next, let's compare the performance of the entire network. We use multiple test tools and methods to test the performance of the two networks. Based on analysis of the test data, we can see that the performance of Huawei's intelligent lossless network closely matches that of the IB network, and even outperforms the IB network in some areas. Now, let's compare the network performance based on actual applications in industries such as meteorology, hydrodynamics, high energy physics. And automobile engineering, according to the test result, the performance of Huawei's intelligent lossless network is basically the same as that of the IB network in various typical HPC applications. To conclude, the performance of Huawei's intelligent lossless network in HPC scenarios is on par with that of the IB network, and even surpasses it in some areas. Well. That's all for this episode of Test It, Believe It. Thanks for watching.